Robert Galarowitz here, and today I want to talk about how to improve your kidney disease by maintaining the acid base, or more commonly referred to as the acid alkaline balance. Now, what exactly is the acid base or acid alkaline balance? Now, throughout the body, uh, it's, your kidneys are in charge of controlling the acid alkaline balance. And what that means, uh, roughly and quickly, is that whenever you're acidic or you have more acid buildup in your body, your body's not going to function as well, and specifically your kidneys aren't going to function as well. And since the kidneys, they maintain that acid alkaline balance, they're always trying to keep the body alkaline by clearing out acid. When there's any type of uh, compromised kidney function, any type of reduced kidney function, it can have a very difficult time maintaining this job, and a lot of times it won't be able to maintain this job. And when there's too much acid built up, it's not only going to make your kidney disease worse and progress quicker, it's also going to cause a host of other problems to a lot of other different uh, systems in your body. Now, I want to talk about how you, starting today, can improve that acid alkaline balance in your body. Now, there was a study that came out, uh, American Society of Nephrology, February 2013, and what they showed was that people who had more fruits and vegetables were able to have a higher um, alkaline balance within their body or a higher uh, base balance in their body. All right, and why this was was because a lot of fruits and vegetables have a high alkaline content and that allows the body to clear out the acids much quicker and it also allows the body to maintain the alkaline balance easier without requiring the kidney to put as much work into this. So by doing this, you're allowing your kidneys to work a lot less, okay? You're going to improve your kidney status and you're going to slow down your kidney disease from progressing further. Now, what they recommend doing, uh, it was consuming more fruits and vegetables, but I took it one step further, and you want to consume more of the low potassium fruits and vegetables. Now, I've got a list here of a couple things that you can start doing today on your next meal, on your next snack, so that you can better your kidney health. First off, apples. Apples are a wonderful, wonderful low potassium, kidney healing, kidney friendly food. They also help your cholesterol, they have fiber, and they do so many other good things for your body. Number two is blueberries. And there's actually been some studies that showing the antioxidants from blueberries help kidney disease and they help kidney function. Third one is cabbage. Okay, cabbage, uh, highly powerful, cruciferous vegetable, does a lot of good things for your body, especially for your kidney. So start incorporating these. And there's so much more that you can do to help your kidney disease, so much more you can do to help improve your kidney function. You know, don't, don't just wait around not doing anything. Be active. Take control of your health to the best of degree as you can. Now there's so many more lifestyle, nutritional, dietary, supplement things you can do. I also have a free video on my website at HealKidneyDisease.com. That's www.HealKidneyDisease.com. Read it over. Take a look at my program. If you have any questions, feel free to contact me. This is Robert Galarowitz, chronic kidney disease sufferer, kidney transplant recipient, and author of the All Natural Kidney Health and Kidney Function Restoration Program. Thanks for watching. Bye.